30-year-old Rob Huff is a race winner in the FIA World Touring Car Championship. I love the Chevrolet car because I feel it's the best package on the grid and I love touring cars because it's fast, furious and very close racing. And 19-year-old Jolian Palmer is the standings leader in the FIA Formula 2 Championship. I love this car because it's fast and it slides around quite a lot. Because at the speeds we're going, there's never a dull moment. They've agreed to trade their pride and joy for a unique experiment that will change their lives forever. This is Car Swap. It's the morning of the swap and Rob and Joe meet at an undisclosed location to exchange vehicles. First up, Jolian introduces Rob to his new wheels. The clutch pedal seems ever so stiff and the gear lever doesn't move much. Hey Rob, these are the gear levers here. Oh, okay. Two paddles, one up and one down. Yeah. Two clutch paddles here as well. So it's quite easy to use once you get the hang of it. Then it's Jolian's turn to meet his new car. Uh, Joe, Joe, what are you doing mate? Uh, there's a door here. Obviously welcome to my office, it's a bit more spacious than yours. Obviously, it's a front-engine, front-wheel drive touring car compared to your rear-wheel drive, rear-engine uh, single-seater. What's the gearbox like on this car? In this car, we have a, a, a five-speed manual gearbox, very different from your flappy paddle gearbox, and we have the traditional three pedals on the floor as well, so you do need to use the clutch. After a few moments to get to grips with their cars, both drivers are thrust out onto the track for their car swap test drive. Steering. Extremely light on this car. The pure power of the thing in a straight line is uh, second to none, absolutely incredible. We use a lot of curb. Something I can't do in the F2 there. What an adrenaline rush. The steering's trying to pull itself the opposite way out your hands, your wrists, you know, you're really working, pumping the arms ever so hard. Oh, massive understeer. Second, third, fourth gear, hit the brakes and turn it in. Incredible. I'm very impressed. Feels quite fun to drive, actually. After the swap is over, the pair meet at a neutral location to discuss their experiences. So, Joe, we've both just had a chance to drive each other's cars. Um, what did you find uh, with the touring car? Well, the first thing I found was the steering makes it quite easy work the steering wise. Excellent brakes in the car. But just the biggest difference to me was just having a roof over my head. You can't really see, see as well, can't really see your lines, your apexes. So um, it was a good change. How do you find the Formula 2 car? Yeah, massively impressive. Um, obviously, the first thing you notice is, is the power as you come out the pit lane. You hear the turbo wind up and the, the boost comes on. And something I've never had the experience to do before with the paddle shift, I couldn't believe how responsive it was. and. Uh, you know, how easily it goes up and down the gears exactly when you want it. I've got to give the, the F2 car 10 out of 10. The power of it, the brake and the aerodynamic grip. To see Rob and Jolian reunited with their original cars, visit Brands Hatch for the FIA World Touring Car and Formula 2 Championships on the 16th, 17th and 18th of July.